Hi all, uh, just bear with me for one second. So um, hi all, my name is Leah Farrell and I will be introducing you to the animation illustration course in AIT. Um, usually on open day, we would have students in face-to-face, -face. we could talk to them, uh, you guys, and we could give them feedback on their work and all that, which is not possible at the minute, but uh, due to COVID-19, but for second best uh, option, this is what we have. So I put together a little presentation for you. So the course is called Bachelor of Arts Honors in Animation and Illustration, and the course code is, hold on. Um, the course code is AL861. AL, um, this is important because when you go into the CEO website, um, this is how you find the course. So AL would be at Lone Institute of Technology, 861 would be the course um, code. Uh, the point you need, points you need to get into this course, um, you will need in total 578 points. Uh, keep an eye on it because this changes every year. Um, this sounds a lot, however, it is combined total of your portfolio assessment scores and your leading search points. I believe it sounds much better this way. The animation and illustration course is combining two major creative industries. It is unique in Ireland in this way. The aim of the course is to give graduating students a well-rounded industry-ready skill set through combining digital and up-to-date skills with traditional well-walked paths. It will take four years to complete the course for which you will achieve a level eight honors degree. Um, the minimum entry requirements, note that these are minimum entry requirements, uh, which means that of course any applicant can exceed them. To get into this course, you will need to have a minimum of two H5s in two subjects and a minimum of H6 in four other subjects. QQI applicants, which would be mature applicants or people from uh, QQI courses, uh, must hold one of the following awards, art, craft and design, 5M18. 1984, art, 5M1985, graphic design, 5M1995, multimedia production, 5N2146, or creative media, 5N5048. Distinctions are required in three modules. This is very important. Further details on the application requirements can be found on AIT's website. And of course, you can always contact the college if you have any queries. All applicants are required to have a portfolio. This portfolio should include only your best work. Uh, we would like quality, not quantity. The detailed list of portfolio requirements can be found on AIT's website as well. However, I will say this, um, keep working every single day. Just keep drawing and keep working away, painting, drawing, whatever you're into. Um, if you do that for three months, I'd say you would have enough work uh, to select from. Um, by the end, um, the modules that you will learn. Over the four years, the students will go through practical modules, which are labs and theory-based lectures. The first year's modules are constructed to create a strong foundation in the student's skill set. First year's theory modules are explorative ideation, creativity in context one and two. Practical modules, labs, are explorative illustration one and two, explorative animation one and two, explorative drawing one and two. One is semester one, two is semester two. Um, that's how it's down and named. Uh, second year follows the first year's modules by building on the existing foundation. Second year's modules are studio illustration one and two, studio animation one and two, studio drawing one and two. Again, one first semester, two second semester. These mainly practical modules are uh, taught with the mixture of traditional and up-to-date techniques. Uh, in addition to these, the students are introduced to narrative and script writing, practice in context, theory in context, into context, teams, and placement preparation to enrich and strengthen the student experiment, as well as creating strong foundation in preparation to third and fourth year. All these modules are spread out through, uh, throughout the year. Uh, into two semesters. Each year, the students will take 60 credits, 30 credits in each semester. Okay, um, third year's modules. Third year is slightly different. 
um, than uh, all the rest of the year. So in third year, the first semester is on campus. Second semester is the students will undergo placements uh, where they will gather real life industry experiences from various studios and companies. During the first semester, the third year students will experience modules like advanced animation, advanced illustration, advanced narrative and script writing, theory in con into context critical issues. The second semester, they will be placed in with companies for the duration of the semester. All through the placement, the students will be given feedback, help and support from the faculty in charge. Um, the fourth year is about the student individuality and it is involved around the student's major project. By the fourth year, the students will have a clearer idea of their artistic identity and this every year, every one of them will be given the platform to showcase this. The first semester of the final year, the students create their preparation for the final project and dissertation. This semester is helping the students finalize their ideas. They will undertake modules like project proposal, final project, advanced drawing, dissertation proposal, and dissertation. Uh, that is what the final semester's modules are called, actually, final project and dissertation. And of course, at the end of the completed four years, students will receive their Bachelor of Honors degree um, from Estonian Institute of Technology. Um, a lot of work during the four years is taking place in labs, um, as I said, practical work um, and practical workshops. All labs and practical work is facilitated by the Institute through well-equipped on-site facilities like computer labs, drawing rooms, animation labs. Um, all staff and faculty at the IT are really approachable. I can say that for myself as well. I'm really approachable. You can come to me anytime. On institute scale, the students are given access to a wide range of student services, which can be accessed through the Student Resource Center. In animation and illustration, the classes are dynamic and upbeat most of the time. Lecturers are supportive and easy to talk to. We encourage students to speak their own mind and create their own artistic language. Careers. Okay. So on the completion of the course, the student professional horizon will include different animation studios, TV and digital media studios, gaming industries, as well as individual artistic practices. Of course, these are always uh, there is always the opportunity to further studies um, in forms of master's degrees and other level nine courses. Um, okay, so this will conclude my presentation. I would like to show you some student work if you don't mind now, and um, perhaps that would help you visualize a bit more uh, what is the course all about. Uh, usually uh, on open days, we would have work. Uh, laid out on uh, the presentation table and students could go through them um, where now it's not the case. We cannot do that. I will show you some student work here. So I will show you some uh, live drawing. Um, trying to go as slow as possible. These works are made by different students, mainly. Uh, sketchbooks. This would be a good guide of what to put into your portfolio as well, in a way. Any more drawings? Um, this is live drawing, but perhaps taken further. So it's not only live drawing, um, there's a bit extra added to it. Um, it's uh, the student's own vision. It's almost an illustration. Okay, illustration, hand paint, the background painting, uh, digital illustration uh, and hand painted mixture. Digital. Um, graphics. Um, this would be a storyboard. Layout, drawings. More layout, this is digital layout. Painted backgrounds digital painted backgrounds, both of them. Uh, character development, more character development. As you can see, the style is, is highly different. Um, okay, so I will show you one experimental film that the students had made. Um, this isn't a graduate film, it's just an experiment. Said that there's no sound to it, so.
Okay, I believe that's it. Okay, so I'm going to show you another film. And I'm only showing you this, hold on, because it's just, it's really nice. Bear with me for one second. Okay, and I will show you another one and then I leave it at that. However, uh, you can keep an eye on AIT's website and uh, the student graduate films are usually um, should be shared there as well. Oh, that's very shaky. All right. Um, I would like to say thank you very much for listening and um, looking forward to seeing you all. Thank you very much. Bye. -bye.